This was a, a shipping container ship that wrecked in Lake Superior. Hey, they say that I'm talking a whole lot of trash. I'm sitting there thinking like, who knew? I know that you've seen us on rappers react. They're talking about us on YouTube. Hollywood six, it look like I do magic. Maybe he's practicing voodoo. I'm hearing you're getting a lot of attention. Well, I'm here to say that we do to deliver the rubbish. I'm What's going on, everybody? We're back with another segment of Rappers React. Smoke dog. What up? I got some cheery for you. Oh, what you got? Let's see. Let me, let me give you some geographical things. All right. Uh, Vatican's... Uh, okay, how about this? Uh, Area 51 is located in which U.S. state? Uh, it's Nevada, right? Correct, correct, yeah. correct. All right, what country touches the Indian Ocean, the Arabian Sea, and the Bay of Bengal? India. Correct. Damn. Uh, okay, what's the city with the most diversity in terms of language? What cities? You would think New York, right? God dang, you on fire today. Yeah. Yeah. You on fire. Okay, let's see. All right, let's see if you can get this. Uh, God, I don't know how I'm. Jesus Christ. Okay. Um, one of the most common words in English language. V. All right. Uh, the Titanic did what? Uh, okay, you got into a car. Oh, wreck. All right. One of the most common words in English language. Uh, the wreck of. All right. So. Oh. I know this song. This is the wreck of the Esmond Fitzgerald. You got it, my friend! <laughs> guys, before we get started, please do us a big, big favor. Y'all, please hit that thumbs up button. Guys, please subscribe to the channel. And for God's sake, leave us a comment and tell us what to react to next. That's how we get the ideas for these videos. Comes directly from you right down in the comment section. And today, Gordon Lightfoot. Gordon Lightfoot. I, I'm glad this is the song because Wait. when I saw it on there, I was like, I know one song by this guy. The Wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald. Why? I don't know why I thought you, I thought you was saying uh, what's the lady singer? Edson Edmund Edson Fitzgerald. Uh, God dang. I don't know. Uh, Edmund Fitzgerald. Uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> Something Fitzgerald. Uh, there probably is. Alma right? Fitzgerald? I can't remember. Maybe. Yeah, I'm not thinking of it right now, though. But you know this song. Yeah, I do. and Because it's uh, a historical. Um, the Edmund Fitzgerald was like... Edda. Edda? Edda Fitzgerald. Wasn't that her name? Maybe. I don't know. No, no, right Edda off Fitzgerald. Hand. Okay. All right, go ahead. I'm sorry. But anyway, uh, this was a, a shipping container ship that wrecked in Lake Superior. True up story. Up in the Great Lakes. Yeah. Hmm. Yep, I, I saw a documentary about it one time, and of course you did. This song was actually in the documentary. That's how I know the song. What what kind of documentary have you not watched? Have you let me ask you this? Have you ever watched a documentary on like carbonated soda? Oh yeah, yeah. Where, where yeah, I did the whole research about where the carbon even comes from. Okay, have you watched a documentary on uh, mice? Oh, of course, yeah. God dang, dude. You <laughs> but no, so Edda Fitzgerald, or not Edda Fitzgerald. What? Edmund Fitzgerald. Edmund Fitzgerald. Yeah. So apparently, okay, his name's Gordon Lightfoot, and I've never yeah. heard of this guy. Yeah, that's the only thing I know. I mean, I don't know much about Gordon Lightfoot at all. Well, or if it even is just a band called Gordon Lightfoot. Could be. I mean, yeah. the Trash Talkers have suggested that we check this out, and the Trash Talkers did inform us that he just recently... Mm -hmm. I, so rest yeah. in peace to well I guess that gives it away it is the lead singer then I would imagine Edmund Fitzgerald who the hell is Edda Fitzgerald I have no clue okay but anyway <laughs> well, who's Edmund Fitzgerald uh, I guess that was when they were making the ship that's who they named it after obviously but yeah it was the ship what kind of music is this what genre mm, I want to say that 70s smooth rock it's not really hard rock. It's definitely not metal or just anything. Rock, just classic yeah, rock. Yeah. Okay. Maybe I might know it when I hear it, but I'll make sure to try to dissect the lyrics. Yeah, definitely. You should because it's an interesting story. So you know the story? Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, I saw a documentary about it. Smoke dog. <laughs> what up? Let's, get it. Let's do it. The Wreck of Edmund Fitzgerald. Rest yeah. in peace, Gordon Lightfoot. Mm-hmm. Kind 
The legend lives on from the Chippewa on down of the big lake they call Gitchagumi. How have you ever heard this? <laughs> it was in the there. lake, it is it's said, doctor, never yeah. gives up her dead when the skies of November turn gloomy. It's got a folky vibe. Yeah, it does. With a load of iron ore, 26,000 tons more than the Edmund Fitzgerald weighed empty. That good ship and true was a bone to be chewed when the gales of November came early. The ship was the pride of the American side, coming back from some mill in Wisconsin. I'm sorry, as the big is a readers go, of it was bigger You're than most, a with a crew yeah. and good captain well seasoned. Concluding some terms with a couple of steel firms When they left fully loaded for Cleveland Then later that night when the ship's bell rang Could it be the north wind they'd been feeling? The wires made a tattletale sound And the wave broke over the railing And every man knew as the captain did too T'was the witch of November come stealing Dude's got a voice though It's straight the to the point The dawn came late and the breakfast had to wait When the gales of November came slashing When afternoon came it was freezing rain in the face of a hurricane west wind Is that the actual Edson Fitzgerald? Yeah. yeah. When supper time came, the old cook came on deck Saying, fellas, it's too rough to feed you at 7 p.m. a main hatchway caved in He said, fellas, it's been good to know ya The captain wired in, he had water coming in And the good ship and crew was in peril I don't even know if Later peril that night when his Thanks. lights went out of sight Came the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald Does anyone know where the love of God goes When the waves turn the minutes to hours The searchers all say they'd have made Whitefish Bay If they put 15 more miles behind her They might have split up or they might have capsized They may have broke deep and took water all that remains is the faces and the names of the wives and the sons and the daughters. Smooth as hell. Lake Huron Roll Superior sings in the rooms of her ice water mansion. Old Michigan steams like a young man's dreams The islands and bays are for sportsmen And farther below Lake Ontario Takes in what Lake Erie can send her and The iron boats go as the mariners all know With the gales of November remembered
In a musty old hall in Detroit, they prayed in the Maritime Sailors Cathedral. Dude, they've been in every city. The church bell chimed till it rang 29 times for each man on the Edmund Fitzgerald. The legend lives on from the Chippewa down of the big lake they call Gitchagumi. Superior, they said, never gives up her dead when the gales of November come early. Edmund Fitzgerald. Yeah. And the crazy thing about this song is I had seen that documentary, right? And they played this song at the end of it. And I was like, so they obviously made a song to go along with the documentary. I was like, so you thought, wait, wait, so you thought the song, they just made the song for Yeah, yeah. I thought they made it just for the documentary. I thought it was like one of those, like, you know, they spent a lot of money on this documentary. They had an artist write a whole song about it. But turns out this was actually a hit song yeah, by Gordon Lightfoot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So did they make the documentary from the Gordon Lightfoot song? Or it was, may have been actually. Or was I mean, it an actual true story about? Oh, it? it's a true story. Yeah. So maybe okay, maybe the it Ed, is Ed, Edmund Fitzgerald. Edmund Fitzgerald. Edmund Fitzgerald, wreck. You know. Yeah. And then Gordon Lightfoot made a song about it. Yeah. And then the documentary came out, and mm-hmm. they put all these things together. Exactly. Yes. Okay. Now. I won't go too deep, but I do want to... Okay, so, and just listening to this song, and I'd like to go deeper into this guy's category because he has that folky that we like. Yeah, you know? yeah. But listening to it, it sounds like there was a ship that was carrying a thousand pounds of ore or something like that, or a bunch of yeah. iron or something. I'd, I'd have to go back through the lyrics, but wasn't it, it, it logs or something? I, I thought I heard ore yeah, or iron. Uh, but, yeah, but whatever it was carrying. Yes. Yeah. So it went down, but my thing is... Why Detroit? Why? I mean, he brought up like seven cities. Because all those cities are around the Great Lakes there. Oh, dude. So they had calls going out to all these ports, you know, like, because I guess when they started capsizing or going down, they started sending out SOS, you know, and all these people were looking for them. But if I remember right, when they got there, it was already sank, so they had to search and search to even find where exactly they were at something happened with their communications i believe and they had a hard time finding them and yeah everyone on there was already dead by the time they figured out exactly where it was have we figured out what sos means save our ship save our ship yeah Hmm. Hmm. yeah that was one of the trivia questions so now god dang it now i want to watch the documentary oh dude that's pretty good hmm Mr. Gordon Lightfoot. Yeah, so great, I, great song to remember the twenty nine people that died that yeah, day. Yeah, and rest in peace to all those people, especially to Gordon Lightfoot as mm-hmm. well. But to see that, I mean, was this like a big thing in the news or something? To where, oh yeah. Well, I mean, what year are we talking? Like oh, decade. What decade? May have been the sixties. I'd have to look that up. I can find out if you want. We can let trash talkers let us know. But sure, sure. Go ahead. Sure, go ahead. Oh, uh, the song was in 76. Uh, so it had to be like between the 50s and the 60s, I would assume. Yeah. Trash talkers, you guys can let us know in the comments section. I'm, I'm oh, just. Wow. It says uh, on July 4th, 1995, divers recovered the Edmund Fitzgerald Bell. So decades later, they were still looking for it. Wow. Wow. Huh. But yeah, it doesn't say right there in that little clip huh? this what is, this exactly is, the year it happened. Yes, and, and not only, but it doesn't tell us exactly all the specifics of the, the incident, the tragic incident that happened. But mm-hmm. what I can say is that me and you sitting here, man, I would have never known about the Edmund Fitzgerald. Oh yeah, exactly. Yeah. Not, not only do the trash talkers, y'all give us such great music, but this is also history lesson. Sometimes yes. for me, sometimes for Smoke Dog. That is awesome that we, we often get songs that actually teach us a history lesson. 
hard. Yes. <laughs> Usually with power metal, but, I, but sometimes you get an old folk track that teaches us what happened from good yeah. old Gordon Lightfoot. Yeah. That, that sounds like a uh, like a frozen dinner. Gor- <laughs> Trust the Gordon's fisherman. Gordon's fisherman. <laughs> yeah. You think they got that from that? Uh, I don't. I don't know. That's kind of because and he got the yellow reach, thing but... and he's got like his <laughs> yeah. leg up. Gordon's fisherman. I'm sure there was a fisherman named Gordon, but. Gordon Life. He, I'm sure he <laughs> Yeah. But yes, thank y'all to the Trash Talkers who sent us over a new person, new band that we've never experienced before, yeah. Gordon Lightfoot. And thank you for giving us backstory on his life. And shout out to Smokey for giving us backstory on the every single documentary <laughs> on earth. We appreciate it. Guys, let us know what's next about Gordon Lightfoot down in the comment section. And with that being said, my name's Behringer Hollywood 6. Bye. I am Larry Smokey Ramirez Cowboy. And we are over and out. Deuces! I want to thank you guys for tuning in to another segment of Rappers React. If you guys want to see another artist that we covered, just click uh, right here. If you want to see the last video did, just click right over here. Thank you so much for spending a little bit of time with us today. Please hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already, and we'll see you on the next one. Deuces!